<laughs> Come in. Howdy, Professor. Howdy, Mac. What is it? Well, I just can't tell you that, uh... That... It had... Uh, Tim Gilman? That you sent? He's here, and he brought his Pikachu. Is that alright? Should I send him in? Yes, please send them in. Alright. Also, you do a favor bring me some coffee, please. And for our guests. Right away, sir. Alright, thank you. No problem, sir. Alright, y'all come in. Hello there, sir. Hello there. Welcome to Book One Prep. Oh, who's this? Uh, that's my one important book on grow life. He he's he's good company around. Oh. <laughs> A little too nosy, if you ask me. All right, girl life, that's enough sniffing. Come over here, boy. Arr, take his heat. Oh. All right then. Um. I before I begin, I apologize for your recent appearance of your father. I hope you find him. Uh, thank you, sir. I hope you find him too. Now then, you must be wondering why I brought you here. I am, sir, and I want to know, why did you call and bring us all the way from Rhyme City to this town? Well then, I would like for you guys to come in. It's just me, Professor. I brought the coffee you asked for. Justin! With the help of my Justin. Oh, for coffee. Oh, yes, coffee. Did someone say coffee? Alrighty. Alright, here's your coffee presser. Thank you, Mac. Oh, that's supposed to be Tim Goodman, right? Uh, yeah, you are? Oh, I'm Mac Green. I'm a student here at the Pokemon prep school. I also, my family and I own the cafe here, and we serve people and Pokemon food. And what and whatever else I need. Oh. Nice to meet you. You too. And your Pikachu. <laughs> nice hat, buddy. Pika. He says thank you. He likes your hat too. Alright, well I brought y'all coffee. Here's one for you, Professor. Oh, uh, is the extra cup for a Pikachu by any chance? Oh. Pikachu? <laughs> Didn't know Pikachu last coffee. Has a new one on me. But, uh, yeah, that one's for him. Here you go, bud. Just sit down on the table, please. Alright. Chespin! Oh, he, this is my partner, Chespin. Chespin! Well, uh, here you go. I'll, uh, get this to you, Oops. Uh, oop, my bad. My bad. Sorry, I, uh, didn't drop that. <laughs> I'm a little bit clumsy. We would never have guessed. Shh, Pikachu. What? Did he say something? Never. Uh, no, he didn't. Huh. All I heard was Pika Pika. <laughs> That's why I thought he said something. <laughs> Still with me. Well, uh... Here's your coffee there. Hope y'all like it. It's freshly made from our... It's freshly made from our cafe. Pika! Oh, he likes it. Says your coffee is delicious. His credits go to the people who made it. <laughs> well, thank you. Glad you like it. Well, I must be on my way. See ya. And, uh, Fressa. 
Should I send the other trainer in? In a moment, okay? Alright. See ya. Come on, Jasmine. Let's go, buddy. Come on, Jasmine. Jasmine! Huh. Well, he's not a jack little kid, ain't he? You can say that again. Anyways. So. Sorry about that interruption. It's okay. Anyways, you must have wondered why I brought you here. Uh, yes, we are. Well then, I want you to solve a mystery case involving an old town legend and a new student. A new student? An old town legend? What do you mean? What I mean is... There's a new student at our school, and she resembles a character, well, I say a character, a character from our old town story. A new student at the school? Character from the story. New student? New student. Okay, what are you doing? Erin, what are you doing around here? I'm Fresh's assistant. But you're not supposed to be around here. No. But there's something going on, and it involves me. What do you mean? Involves you. J just listen, okay? Come on. Just listen. Just <sighs> always close that door. You just left at the back door. So, what do you mean that this involves this old town story? What I mean is, this town was founded by a family a long time ago. It used to be a kingdom, and the princess Mirabelle was called the Pokemon Princess. They called her that for her, for her ability with Pokemon. Ability with Pokemon? Like a special connection she has Pokemon. She understands what they're saying. And she could friend any kind of Pokemon. Including legendaries. And in the story, it's pictures of a brown cat with a strictly side on her face and blue eyes. And she looks, and nowadays, she looks exactly like a trainer that we know here. Nowadays. A trainer. Uh, what is the princess's name? Mirabelle. The new trainer is named Katarina Pawson. Wait, what? Wait a second. So, Mirabelle looks like you? No wonder I could use her, you for her. For this old town story. Can't believe it. So, sir, what are you saying is, you think this new student could be like a descendant of Mirabelle? It's a theory, it's a, well, theory, but both the girl Mirabelle and Katarina bear a striking resemblance. It's uncanny how much they look alike. It's so uncanny that... There could be a relationship, relation, or a resemblance between them. Like she could be like a descendant? That's what we're trying to figure out. And that's what we called you guys. You can handle, you think you can figure out this old town story. And solve the mystery? What do you say? Old town story. Mystery. 
and it involves me and some princess from this town long ago, back when it was a kingdom. And I could be a relative to the princess? A distant, like a distant relative or like a distant, well, distant princess? I could be related to book one princess? Like a, this is crazy, Aaron. It, it can't be true. Can it? I don't know, Kate. I really don't know.